That's the opposite of starting it. Mm-hmm. What the fuck do you want me to do? Like, you're like, start it. So I press bow, and then you're like, I'm not doing nothing, not saying nothing. I'm supposed to talk. Mm-hmm. I don't even know if I'll be able to hear me. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Well, God damn it! <laughs> Why did you jump? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Who's been beating on you? Your son. <laughs> He's four, woman. <laughs> I can't hit him back. <clears throat> I don't know what you're scratching. There's like peach fuzz. It's a lot of peach in his wound. That's pubic hair. This over here is like peach fuzz. You know what peach fuzz is? What well, grows on your butt? <laughs> You're hard. Uh, you yeah. You smoke too much weed. Mm, not yet. That's for after the video. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. What the fuck do you want me to do? Read it. I'm supposed to read this shit. Oh dear God. <laughs> Better than your handwriting. Well, fuck, I'm the only handwriting. one in the world that can read my handwriting. And doctor. I can barely manage the fucking. I can tell when you recite your lyrics and stuff. Yeah, I know, right. <laughs> fuck! <laughs> fuck! <laughs> okay, well, I guess we'll start with question number one. <laughs> Who is your favorite horror slasher? Why am I quizzing myself? <laughs> well, who is your favorite horror slasher? Jason. Um, I will have to say Jason as well, or the Leprechaun, Warwick Davis, the original Leprechaun, the new movie. Because they look alike. Well, you're dumb. Dumb. Mm -hmm. Well, my dick looks like him. It's the same size and everything. The fucking new one though sucks ass. WWE can suck a dick. Hornswoggle can suck a dick. Um. Yeah, that's that. That that's how that goes. Um. Next question. What is your biggest guilty pleasure, Miss Kitten? Food. Food. <laughs> Dude, you're fucking interesting. <laughs> I like uh, food. I like food too. My biggest guilty pleasure. Co Co Cola. <laughs> <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> um, biggest guilty pleasure. Mmm. I don't know. Tell me my answer was wrong. No. That's bullshit. <laughs> don't pin that shit on me. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Uh, fuck. Food? Food? No, <laughs> maybe. Cheese? <laughs> cheese? Cheese? Lots of fucking cheese. I don't really see you eat much cheese. Are you serious? I'm not even gonna say that. I might lose my job. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, well then, maybe. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> Cartoons? You don't even, I don't even ever see you watching those! I'm the one who owns all the Dragon Ball Z fucking DVDs and all that shit. We, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. We'll just go with Coke. What a. <laughs> No, that's not even true. Uh, um, porn? Can you make a meatloaf? Yes. Can, can you? I can. 
I don't believe you. Men can't make meatloaf. I can make anything. Can out make of a, Coke? Out of fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I can make a baby in your fucking uterus. Um, I can make meatloaf. She can make... She can take a meatloaf. <laughs> uh... What are you... What are you looking forward to the most being a badass mom? You were um, a mom for like two years? I was a mom for like two and a half years. <laughs> um, my favorite thing, or the thing I'm looking forward to most about being a badass being mom... Being at work while I'm a mom. Fuck you. <laughs> no. Um, I guess it's probably my luscious breast assistances. That's probably it. I think your balls get bigger when I'm pregnant. My balls get bigger every day just because I'm <laughs> awesome. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, honestly, I was a mom for like two and a half fucking years. Um, I got a four-year-old son I had custody of since he was seven months old. And, yeah. Mr. Mom. Mm-hmm. That's when I got the titties. Um, what? I'm looking forward to sleeping while he's a mom. Yeah. We're already six minutes in and we're only <laughs> on fucking question number five now. <laughs> question number five. What are you guys most mutually passionate about? Coke. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. I've never done it. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't do drugs anymore um <laughs> what do you what what are what are we both most mutually passionate about our careers probably music if you couldn't tell the kids mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what she said I, i'll co-sign to that not before my sister i think of it was sex oh oh yeah mm -hmm. yeah yeah i got us to the apartment yeah, it did get us the apartment. <laughs> it did get us the apartment. Fucking tantric then, Satan sex magic. Two days later, we got pregnant. <laughs> mm, that's true, too. Uh, how did you guys meet each other? Was it the gathering? It was the gathering 2014. Well, Frodo was carrying a Mac on me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it was a gathering, 2014. Um, she was walking around with the homeboy, and I was like, "Look at them butt cheeks." And then some same person brought me over to their studio. And she was a stuck-up bitch. I was not. I didn't know him. No. Yeah, she did. She. I was she, shy. No. She was talking to me on Facebook, and I didn't know that's him. And all bullshit. And I was like, "What's up?" And she was like, <laughs> "I said hi." No, you didn't. You didn't say a word to me. <laughs> you, didn't even, you didn't even acknowledge my existence. It was like I was invis invisible. <laughs> I don't even remember you being there. Yeah. Well, exactly. Uh, no, maybe I do because I they were asking me to be in your video. Because they were asking me to spin fire. Yeah, I remember. And somebody like, was like, oh, you're you going to be in my video. You were in this little, little bitty tiny outfit and all the assiness was hanging out. And I was like, again, look at them butt cheeks. Now they're bigger. They are. It's great. Um, what is your strongest pregnancy craving so far? I haven't really had any. Except before we even knew I was pregnant for like a month straight, all I wanted was fried pickles. Not pickles, but fried pickles. And he hates fried He hates pickles. He made them for me at work. I would bring them home. Because apparently I'm not allowed to make them here. I've been continuously making her fried pickles at work, and I can't even stand the smell of pickles. <laughs> That's fucking love. Um, my strongest pregnancy craving so far is sex. Se <laughs> <laughs> you were gonna hit me. <laughs> Why would I do I that? Blue face. Why would I do that? <laughs> I've never, I <laughs> ever, ever. I, I asked earlier, who the fuck's been beating on you, woman? Your son. <laughs> yeah, right. I have not been to Niagara Falls, Canada. You said you have. Have I? 
Is that in Canada? Oh yeah, it's, we, it's we between talked about this. Like, I've been in it for like ten minutes, and then we saw it, and then we left. I had only Niagara Falls that I have seen is. I don't know if I should say that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, <clears throat> let's just say Niagara Falls all over the bed. No, let's not do that just in case my <laughs> mom sees this video. We're not going to say that. <laughs> um, scale of one to ten, number nine. Question number nine. Scale of one to ten, ten being scared shitless. How nervous are you about the baby? Twelve. I'm like negative three because I have two already. Mm. Yeah. I've already got to take care of two of yours. This is us my, combined this, is going to be terrible. Yeah, this is this is my third, and um, I'm just excited. I love being a dad. Love everything about it. He doesn't it, have to push it out of his pee hole. You don't have to push it out of your pee hole either. No, it's just gonna feel like I'm pushing it out of my butt hole. I've seen the videos. They say their butt hurts. Well, that's because you're pushing so fucking hard. But, uh, it's uh, every woman's vagina is different. Should give him a laxative before the baby's born. So that we both poop ourselves together. Be great. <laughs> that would be a very unsanitary <laughs> environment for our child to be delivered into. Okay. <laughs> so, Don't put your hands in your pants. Man, we're already 12 fucking minutes. Um, How did you get started modeling? How did I get started modeling? Mm -hmm. How did you get interested in it? You can say that you've modeled, so you can actually honestly answer that question. Well, I have, but like, I, I, I'm an artist, so I have to do photo shoots mm -hmm. and shit. He's a model. I am a monster. That's not how models pose. That's how I pose, and I'm a model, so eat and a that's dick. That's why your modeling career hasn't gone very far. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I did, I do photo shoots and shit for my. Uh, he does illegal, illegal activities while he does his photo shoots, like writing on walls. Like writing on walls? Bang bang was written on the wall. Oh, uh huh, yeah, mm -hmm. I guess. That was just, uh, that was during uh, Photo of the Ghost uh, video shoot, um, which the video was never made. And Nobody would have given it a shut shit. Just <laughs> shut up. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been a dope video if it was made. Because I've had two like. Two guys in it. Huh? With two guys in it. So dope. It was a great, <laughs> it was a great fucking location. I wasn't even in the video myself. What were you doing there? I was fucking giving them ideas and fucking holding props. and Or not holding props, but filming the filming. And, uh, other Wasn't that Andrew Pierce's job? I know, he was filming the video. I was filming him filming for, like, behind the scenes Film shit. Inception. Some, I, yeah, like Leonardo DiCaprio Inception of video camera. I'm a camera oh. whore, and. Uh, that's about it. Take pictures of myself all the time, so why not? Get paid to have other people take pictures of me. Nope. Where are we at? Eleven. Eleven. If you could travel to three countries, where and why? It's a country, right? <laughs> I'm kidding. Did you seriously fucking <laughs> say that? She wasn't kidding. <laughs> She wasn't kidding. She seen the expression I had on my face and then was like, I said something stupid and said she was kidding. <laughs> Germany. I don't really want to go anywhere else. I really want to go to Germany. Well, you just have... You're just so adventurous. 
you can't think of three countries out of the 160 or 196 countries on the planet. Three. Just three. No, no. Germany. Germany. And the state of Japan. And the state of Japan. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, I would probably have to say, because I'm like a big history buff, um, I would love to go to Japan, because I'm also an anime nerd. Um, and I, I just want to go to a cat cafe. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be dead when I leave, I, though, because I'm allergic. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, I would love to go to fucking Egypt. That would be dope. Hopefully I get cursed by a mummy or something like Egypt that. Egypt would be cool. Egypt would be fucking dope. Um, maybe, like, Peru to see the Nazca Lines or, um, wherever Tuatiwakan is, I forget. Um, or, like, India to see all those ancient temples and shit. I love all that kind of stuff. Um, number 12, how old are you? How old are you? I'm 22. Well, that's good, because I thought you were 17. Now I'm not in trouble. Uh, 17 is legal in Missouri. Yeah, but not for me, because I'm 32. You're I'm totally not, not. I'm not 32. I'm 24. She's 22. She's going to be 25. Yeah. Um, in like She's old. Three weeks. April old. 16th. I'm so fucking old. I'm a quarter of a century old. The dust on my balls has dust on its balls. Um, what are you naming the child? Pugsley. <laughs> Sir Lancelot. <laughs> mm. Mm. Well, are you are you gonna say for real or? <laughs> Is there Harley Eden? Rain, maybe, or just Harley Eden, or Lilith. Was there an Eden after that? Eden's in every, every. Lilith, Eden, Rain, something like that. Or if it's a boy, David or Dante, Loki. You heard it straight from the cat's mouth. Mm -hmm. Uh. Mm -hmm. Fourteen. Fuck Mary. Kill. Do I have to answer these? We talked about this. I don't remember what my answers were. Now I'm scared. We didn't talk <laughs> about answers, but we're like, we talked about it. Mmm. 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 Better pick right or I know who I'm killing. <laughs> Curious. <laughs> I don't know. Mary Monoxide. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Fuck this. <No. laughs> <sighs> Anyways. Hmm. Who? What? Do this. What's good? Um, you failed already, but come on. Just answer. Hmm. I'm saving myself for marriage. Says the pregnant woman. Mary was pregnant. Huh? Mary got pregnant. Yeah, by me. Please. Might be them actually all blowing up my phone. <laughs> oh my god, you'll get your booty video! No, right I lied. Now. What is it? 
No, I was talking to them. I said I lied. She lied. You're not getting to play video. I totally didn't lie. You're getting a booty video. I didn't say from Hill. 2009. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can go pay some, like, yes. broke down lady. Just get some corner. homeless bag lady to come and shake her ass on the camera for you guys. How would you like that? But no, for real, thank you. Past 3,000 likes today on the AZ to phone page, so you're fucking cool in my book. Uh, um, we didn't do the fuck, Mary kill. Or whoever, whoever picked that question, fuck you, because we're skipping it, I guess. Um, 15, JRB or Killjoy Club? JRB? Yeah, that's my question. Okay, JRB, what do you mean by that? Because Juggalo Riders, bitch, is just something they said in the song. There's, there's just, there's the Riders, which, um, there's no fucking way you can compare Riders to Killjoy Club, because that whole album was fucking garbage, in my opinion. Not all of it. Well, there was like it. surprise was cool. There was like a couple songs on there that was all right, but Young Wicked probably is the only like he's the one that did the best out of all of it. Um, why don't you spin anymore? Because it was cold. Yeah, well, I and she did that. Fuel is expensive. But now it's not cold, and he makes money, so I'll be spinning soon. Um, huh. who is your favorite comic book character? Deadpool! Deadpool. <laughs> your answer is valid. Or Spawn. Mm -hmm. Also valid. But nothing compares to Goku. I'm sorry, Goku. Goku. Imagine a Deadpool Goku. Hmm? Imagine a Deadpool Goku. Hmm, I would... I'd be scared. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mind blown. What is your most disturbing picture you've ever been sent? A guy said if I replied to him, he'd fuck his chicken. And he sent a picture of the chicken. I didn't reply. <laughs> Save the chickens. Oh, That's no. fucking gross. I hate chickens. I hate ducks and chickens and large birds. So. Mmm. Most disturbing picture I've ever been sent. Is your ex count? <laughs> oh, maybe, maybe. Um. Most disturbing picture I've ever been. I don't know, but he sends me shit. Um, this one time, I I used to get a lot of random titty pictures from just some mmm, just mmm. It 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 was disturbing. Was disturbing. I don't know. I'm not the one that like. She probably gets fucking nasty shit in her inbox all the fucking time. I know everybody likes to send her dick pics and shit because you creeper, dick picking, dick pickers. It's always the small dicks too. <sighs> don't say that because you're gonna be like, I people are gonna be like, my penis ain't small. I guess I can send her a pic. That's not be the, minuscule. That is not the case. <laughs> mm -mm. Um, she will and has if you send dick pics she will post them to her page and make fun of you she done it multiple times I used to get paid to do it I'm like a pro at it mm. what's next you better keep track of this shit than me we're already at 24 minutes is this gonna go on YouTube I don't um, know if it'll yeah, fit yo it will. What is your favorite food? Hot wings. Hot wings. 
hot wings or pizza, but hot wings. Steak. Hot wing pizza is king. Um, I don't like pizza. Yeah, I know you don't like pizza, but I, we we both answered the questions. Okay? And you said hot wings or steak, mm -hmm. and I said hot wings and pizza. But if you mash them together, it's like a fucking perfect... Cover some steak tips and like hot wing sauce. Might be pretty good. Might be, but you don't know yet. We'll have to figure that out. I'm pregnant. I can find out. Oh, <laughs> uh, go. <laughs> what is that now? Back to question. Pregnancy craving seven. <laughs> yeah. Hot wing steak. <laughs> Buffalo dipped steak. Ugh. Um. What's my favorite outfit to wear? Nothing. Or little to nothing. Or my Pikachu outfit. <laughs> Usually my Pikachu outfit. Or my uh, Hello Kitty footy pajamas. Hmm. Um. What's your favorite outfit to wear? Better say the green button up shirt. Actually, I was going to say her Hello Kitty footy pajamas. He does it when I'm not here. Nah, I, I also wear her lingerie. That's why her her shit keeps ripping up. Uh, <laughs> actually, um, my favorite outfit. Um, I love my fucking twisted jersey I got from the uh, gathering. I like to wear that shit all the time. Uh, after I got it, people were like, um, "Have you changed since the gathering?" I was like, uh, "Long enough to put this in the washing machine, cause it's fucking awesome." Was that number twenty one? Do you like thick girls? Mhm. Mm I don't like fat girls. I like obese. I like mm. thick girls though. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. There's got to be. There's like a ratio. There's a, there's a weight limit. There's a yeah. There's a boob to ass to belly ratio that's going on. Um. Why do you go by so many names? I really don't go by many names. Kitten. My oldest name I've gone by is Morbid Envy, but that was my tattoo name. And then there's my birth name. And Kitten Envy. Mm. And, and my old cam name. That was about it. And I don't go by many names. My name is Tony. What's Cash Reap? I was Cash Reap for like 10 fucking years. Because uh, I, I got that name when I like... I first started to like pursue rap. Uh, well, like I always pursued rap. I uh, practiced for a long time, but when I started writing my own stuff, I was like 15 and I went by the name Cash Reap. And I kept that shit. I started recording when I was 18 and kind of just got stuck with it. Now I'm about to be 25 and I'm like, fuck this shit. It's got to change. He goes so, by daddy, not by me. But. <laughs> And Mr. Bigglesworth. That's what he likes to be called during sex. Oh, because, yeah, because that's exactly what, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, there's AZ, Cash Reap, Daddy, Azazel. Twatzilla called him that. Nasty. Not even for the Daddy Dom and Baby Girl thing, just because she has daddy issues. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> this is probably gonna get seen. Ah, oh, crap. That's why she's a stripper. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, this is not good. Can we send pussy pics? Yes. Oh, yeah. I like cats. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Do penguins have knees? Can we break them and find out? Um. I look up and see if penguins have knees. First question. <laughs> do penguins have knees? Oh crap. I penguins know penguins do have knees. Oh <laughs> I know nuns have knees. And they're on them a lot. Hmm. Praying. To his dick.
Um, 25. All of this is directed at me. AZ, what would be your ultimate lineup of artists you could do a show with? Well, I've done the gathering multiple times, so that's, that's probably the best thing ever. Um, what? What? <laughs> But honestly, like if I could, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> if I could just be like, a, like a random show, like say, I could put together the ultimate show with myself and three other artists at Pops, you know, like a St. Louis show. It would probably be. What are you? It would probably be twisted. They suck. That's why I want to marry them. It would probably be, <laughs> uh, it would probably be like twisted. <laughs> twisted. I'm not. I can't t do this right because it'd be like twisted. And then Ritz or Sess Crew, one of the two. Lo if I could do Lotus, that would be all of them together and me. Lotus and me, yeah. Um, but it would be like Twisted, Sess Crew, or Ritz. Do you want to do a show with Big Hoodoo? No. No. Um, <laughs> and Busy Bone. Shit, man, that was so hard just to get out. Thank you. Yeah, so like Twisted, Sess Crew, and Busy Bone. I think that would probably be, in my opinion, yes. Um, so what's the meaning of life? Food. Pregnant woman. <laughs> um, and sex. Yes. That's, that's a good but... So that you can make more people, and then they can eat food, and then have sex and die. I Life. Love, I love you. I love you. Um, the meaning of life, in my opinion, is like this shit's. Uh, it's, this shit's gonna always go on. So, your only fucking purpose, and I shut the fuck up before <laughs> I stick my dick in that hole. Your fucking patent. Uh. <laughs> The <laughs> ah. <laughs> it's always going to go on. So your only purpose in this life is to eat, eat fucking die. <laughs> no, <laughs> you got to leave this place in a better fucking place than when you got here. To clean up your plate. <laughs> That's something to hit her with. Um... <laughs> That my exactly. Thing. That's my thing. You can be a positive or you can be a negative. It, that's the whole world. Everything is made up of positive and negative charged particles. So you can be a positive or a negative. And if you are a negative, then you're a waste of fucking space. So be fucking positive influence on the fucking world around you. That's the meaning of life, yo. Um, while you're down there. <laughs> um. Where are we at? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, marriage, is that in both of your future together? Yes. No. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is that's the plan. So he oh. says. Everything I've fucking said so far has, has come to fruition, has it not? Apparently. Exactly. Because I know what the fuck Dick. I'm doing. Yeah. I'm God. Um, how do both of you feel about becoming parents? I miss alcohol. <laughs> so um, much. Yes. 
Uh, I am already a parent, as we have covered. I have two children. I have a four-year-old little boy and a seven. He's Satan. He is not. I am. Uh, <laughs> I got a four-year-old little boy. He's fucking awesome. She's Satan. a hater. Shut up. Good God. And I have a seven-month-old little girl. Also Satan. In a quiet way. Mm -hmm. You can close that door and count to three seconds before she cries. Because you've closed the door. Satan. And she's fat. <laughs> <laughs> what are you least looking forward to? Like she'll, she'll figure it out when our baby gets here. That is also Satan. It's a house full of Satan. Tell me that it That's ain't. It's because they're my spawn. But they're all fucking awesome. What is the last movie you sat through and thought, why the hell did I pay for this crap? Ouija. Ouija. That movie was <laughs> fucking horrible. I paid 20 fucking dollars for that goddamn DVD, and it was garbage. Garbage. And I'm a fucking Ouija board fanatic. Oh, this is going to take forever. I got Ouija hats, Ouija backpack. I, that movie was crap. Can we do that one last? Your tat. Number 30 last. Okay, your tats and meetings, your sub names. We can answer that one and the other ones, but we can do the tattoos last. Anyway, okay, number 31. Will you show off your tats, just the faves? At the end of the video. Okay. Number 32. Are your nipples twisty fresh, and if so, what time of the day? Three. Now my nipples are always twisty fresh. I, I can show you at the end of the video if you'd like. Um, number 33, ass mouth. What's the most romantic thing your man has done for you? Bought me fast food twice in one day. What the fuck is a pregnant woman? I forget. <laughs> Never mind. I got you. Like, okay. That's the most romantic thing. Okay. Ass. It's the most romantic thing your man has done for you. My man? Did no, you, no, I wear the pants in this relationship. Did you grow a dick sometime in the last... I've had a dick. You've seen my dick. You got a mental dick. You've seen, you've seen my dick. Every time I pull my own pants down. You've seen Big Blue? That's what I call my balls when she's not putting out. Favorite Mountain Dew? Code Red or Voltage? Hold on. Hold that. I'm not holding it. Or don't hold it. Whatever. <laughs> it's the most exercise he's gotten in so long. I'm kidding. <laughs> Bitch, I work 50 hours a week. Standing. Do the Oh, whatever. What's a guy gotta do to get tattooed by you? Make an appointment. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, he does tattoos too. Mm hmm. Do you play video games? Yeah. It's my Xbox. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. But she's scared to play me in fucking uh, Call of Duty. I hate that game. I hate Call of Duty. I'll play Halo, though. She ain't played me that either. It's because we don't own it. Yeah, I know. Well, we will. And I'll keep your ass, just like a Call of Duty. What's your favorite toy as a kid? A stick and a rope. Um. Tamagotchi. <laughs> we was broke as fuck. I have no goddamn Tamagotchi. I did end up getting a Pikachu pet, like one. 
Mm. What's your favorite memory with your love? What's yours? I've been asking them for answering them first. You first. Maybe it's the time I fucked you so hard I ripped the back off, or the skin off of your back. It's a true story. I have a scar. Then she does. Show him. Okay. Show him the fucking. Turn around and show him the scar. It's like a fucking scar, like. <laughs> From the carpet, because I had her legs behind the back of her head. Indian style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was awesome. Um, maybe, um, I can't. The, the day we got the apartment, ha ha. Ha ha, <laughs> you just pulled for some dumb, she's such a hater. I was just joking when I said what I said. Honestly, probably my favorite memory was... The ride was... home from dropping off Clarissa. <laughs> 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 yeah, that That's was... That's where we started. Yeah. Ish. No, we started, started in a fucking IHOP. You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> actually, honestly... My favorite memory would probably be the uh, the first time that we got to hear the baby's heartbeat. That'd probably be it, for real. Then after that would be the ripping her back skin off by fucking her. Um, Which is around the time the baby was made. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Would you make a porno? We have made many. They're all on my phone. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What's your favorite scary movie? Jeepers Creepers, you just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> like, I wouldn't go out on the 23rd of every month. She's a pussy. Because I lived across the street from a cornfield. <laughs> It was scary. Pussy. My dad was a dick. He would hide on the roof and have my mom send us out to his truck for cigarettes and then he would jump off the roof and scare us after we watched Jeepers Creepers. Dick. Hmm. Well, my favorite scary movie. Um, I don't know. I never watched a movie that was genuinely scary. Um, Freddy vs. Jason is a shit. I thought that was dope. He likes it because there's boobs. There's like the perfect combination of like gore and boobs and fucking comedy. It's funny. Um, or again, the Leprechaun movies. They're not scary. I just love those fucking movies. Um, what's your favorite kind of food and drink? Hot wings and booze. Mm-hmm. What Wrong. she said. What she said again. <laughs> how does it... Oh, wait. My bad. What's your... No. How do... <laughs> fuck! Shit, fuck, fuck! This is an hour-long video. These people are pissed right now. Uh, how does it... Suck being recognized as a super cool, beautiful model in public? Well... For me, it sucked because I always get bombarded with all these, you know, random... Fat girls. Yeah, you know, girl, I wish they were girls. Oh, gosh. No, but no, obviously that was, was directed for you because... Shit. Um... It doesn't really suck. I just don't know what to do. Cause I've, I was on the train in Massachusetts and I had people that were like, you're getting envy. And I'm like, shit, I'm on a train with you for 11 yeah. hours. Yeah. But mostly I've met you guys like at concerts and stuff and it's pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, most I of I have no problem meeting you guys as long as you're not creep bags. Hmm. Hmm. Which there are a lot of those in her business. A lot. A lot. Um... 
me, I run into most of uh, my fans at concerts also. Funny, funny thing. You know, but anytime I ran into a fan, it's just fucking awesome because I'm like, you actually know who the fuck I am? Like, don't do that. I did it. Don't do it. I will B word you on camera. Your son's asleep. What? I'm not talking about bitch. I'll call you bitch, bitch. I'm talking about your name. I will name you. Ah, oh, see, she don't like that. She <laughs> likes me called bitch. Um, I don't know the other name. <laughs> uh, Stop petting my fat. It's my baby. No. It's um, my belly. Okay. I can okay. Love uh, okay, baby. What is your favorite superhero plus villain? Deadpool is not a bad guy. Deadpool and the Joker. Hmm. Okay. I would marry them both at once. Well, luckily they're fictional characters, so I'm still in the clear. Um, my favorite yeah, super. I think the movie comes out. One of them already killed himself, but I think Jack Nicholson's still alive. Yeah, Jack Nicholson's still alive. If you want to go for him, go for it, sweetheart. <gasps> Betty. Oh, yeah. Uh, my favorite superhero, again, Goku. Um, villain would, it would have to be the Joker or Majin Buu. I like Kid Boo. Yeah, yeah, specifically Kid Boo. Um, what's up with people always talking shit to you? They hate us because they ain't us. They hate us because they ain't us. Mm -hmm. eh, simple. Bow. Eh, don't drop it. Don't fart. We're on camera. Did I say that out loud? What music did you grow up on? Like, what did your parents listen to? And did that influence the music you'd like now at all? I hate country music. Well, I, that was not the question. It was that what music... That is the music... answer to the question. <laughs> country music, and now I hate it. Ah. Well, me, uh, my mom always listened to country music and 80s, which I... Can't stand 80s pop at all. Um, not all country music is wretched, but I like the old shit, like Johnny Cash. Uh, my dad, however, is my most influential uh, music, which was rock music, um, old stuff like Guns N' Roses, ACDC, Metallica, um, Ozzy and Black Sabbath. <laughs> um, face itched uh, also he's also the one responsible for getting me into rap music um, because he had this tape he always played all the time with uh, Sugar Hill Gang on it and, which is like the very first rap you fucking die <laughs> which is like the very first rap group uh, Sugar Hill Gang you know to hip hop hip, 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 hip hop and uh, Naughty by Nature, like uh, Freaks Come Out at Night and shit like that. Old, old, old rap music. That's where it got me started with that, and I just fucking loved it. And then when I was like seven years old, I discovered ICP. And it's been a rap ever since. Uh, <laughs> like his career. Ha ha ha, yuck. <laughs> what a great pun. Uh, where do you buy your clothes? Goodwill. Thrift stores. Um, well, if I see something that I think is dope, then I buy it. If she sees something that she thinks is cute or pretty, then I buy it. I don't... He's been trying to buy me clothes. I haven't she's, been really doing she, it. Yeah, because she's... Whatever. Um, if you had a chance to... <laughs> 
She wants to make this video for an hour and a half. I swear she's going for it. Why are you jumping? <laughs> if you had a chance to make a video with one celebrity, who would it be and why? And so I can do this to his because <laughs> he's beautiful. I love <laughs> um, me, it will probably be a video. I would make a video with monoxide because he's also beautiful. That's not the reason. Um, it would be... Why not the fat kid? Well, ex-fat kid, why he don't get no love? Because he's not fat no more. It said one person. I'm sorry. If the, Twisted. If you, the, they're Siamese twins. Okay, so they count. So Twisted. And I would make a twerk video with them. It would be beautiful. It would be the three of us just twerking. I to think like, the next side could do a better job twerking. I, 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 I don't doubt it. Um, it would <laughs> be the three of us twerking to like ice cream man tunes. <laughs> Have you seen what Ghetto has done with they can do with like just cartoon music and stuff? Who? Pretty, there's like videos where they turn like just cartoons, like kid cartoons, like the little Einsteins into music. Oh no. And twerk to it. Um, I'm pretty sure they could do that. That's it. a joke answer. Or is it the real answer? I think it's the real one. It probably the real I'd twerk answer. with my next side. It would probably though I would I'd make my next side twerk on me. Uh, if we, if I had a chance to make a video with, uh, one celebrity, it would be the Siamese twins known as Twisted. Why? Because they're fucking Twisted. Um, favorite show? Hmm. Markiplier. Does that count? It's a show. It's a YouTube channel show. It's, it's. It's a YouTube. It's not a show, though. It's just like sometimes his videos are two minutes, sometimes they're twenty-five. Dragon Ball Z. You stole my answer. You, you were gonna steal my answer. No, I was she born was first. Let me stick with Markiplier. I, I was gonna. I'm, I'm gonna fuck you in the butt. <laughs> well, I watched Dragon Ball Z. Okay. Well, yeah, I would say Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z is my favorite show of all times. Then, I, I can't, it's too fucking hard though, because like, I, I say Dragon Ball Z is, is, is always going to be the top, but then like, there's Fringe, which is awesome, and Stargate, and I'm going to make a fucking show about me beating the fuck out of her, <laughs> and that will be my number one favorite show. <laughs> uh, mm. If you could move anywhere in the world... Where would you move to and why? Auschwitz! No, I'm kidding. Because she's a fucking Jew. And that's where Jews go. No offense to any Jews. Jesus. Offense to any Jews. Frodo. Half a Jew. He's like half of a half of a Jew because of his height. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not anti-Semitic at all. Yes, he is. I'm... See how many likes your page goes down now? Mm-hmm. Fucking you. <laughs> um, me, I would... Where would I move? I would move to the island of Fuck It in Thailand. I think it's a real thing. It is a real thing. Seriously. It is. It's a real thing. It's the fucking dopest fucking island in the fucking world. Um, there's a movie called The Beach with uh, Leonardo DiCaprio. 
Uh, it's a crazy ass movie. It's dope. The whole like middle of the island in the movie is full of weed. I don't believe that that's real, but I don't care. I bring my own weed. Um, the, the fucking place is awesome. Um, it's beautiful. Or what it was just called. Uh, fuck, what was that place? There's like this crazy ass fucking cave in like. In like Taiwan or, or another like over there, another little fucking tiny Asian island. It's like fucking eighty something miles of cave. It's got a fucking jungle inside of it and rivers and lakes. It's like a whole fucking little ecosystem inside of a fucking cave. It's awesome. No one cares. <laughs> well. She's a big fucking hater, and you can eat a dick. Um, will we be at the gathering? Nope. Yeah. <laughs> no. We won't be at the gathering. <laughs> we'll be all up at the gathering. We will be at the gathering. We, yeah. Easy to follow. You can gather in his butt. Be at the gathering. No. Condoms, um, though. I don't, I don't want to catch your guys' diseases. But I will write that his butthole to you. And then when he's big and famous, you can say you fucked him in the butt. And your lives will mean something. <laughs> to the moon! Um, if you could poop on somebody's car with no consequences, whose car would you choose? Hazards. Mm. Yes. Mass man hazard. Yes. Yes, sir. Just because you asked that question, you are the car who... It's your car that gets shit on. See you at the gathering. Yes. 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 Wow. Uh, well, while you're shitting pass, on the, what, the windshield? Well, if he doesn't have a car pass, I'm pooping on his tent. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Or I'll just walk out to the parking lot and I will poop on his car. And that has like three days to sit. Yeah, right on the dash, so it gets all hot and fucking steamy. Uh, and the steering wheel. I don't have a gallbladder. And the... <laughs> now I know why the fucking <laughs> bathroom's <question>. always nasty, <laughs> stinking ass. Um, are you going... Are you? Am I going to breastfeed? As soon as you pop them titties out... I've thought about it. I haven't fully decided yet. If anything, I might pump for a little bit. But my boobs are really sensitive. That's what they're made for. Not after metal has been ripped out of them. I don't even know if they'd work. I don't know. I don't know. Metal we'll find out if further into my pregnancy them. I can squirt boob milk out of my boobs. Well, you can squirt from other orifices, so I don't know why you couldn't squirt from your boobs. Mm -hmm. Well, um, that's all 52 questions, and we're at 58 minutes and 30 seconds. Better show you tattoos. Seconds. They were your tattoos. Nope. My tattoos didn't get asked about. Show your tattoos, young money. <laughs> they did not ask about you my were tattoos. So Shut up. Yo, you're that dude. <laughs> It's up. The baby? You better show me your tattoos. Show me your tattoos first. No. <laughs> My tattoos suck. Because I was a Ooh. fucking teenager that would get tattooed but by fucking dumbasses with homemade guns. But you this is my most... by dumbasses with tattoo guns. It was one time and I was fucking drugged. Coke. No. <laughs> this is my most recent. This was done by her. Bye. It is the sigil of a Zezo. 
Carved into my chest. It means pie. I like pie. Azazel is the god of pie. I don't think that I've that's... I've dubbed this so... I don't think that that's correct. This is... <laughs> <laughs> that's the logo. That's the other logo. I hit a penis in it. That is a fucking bomb and a mushroom cloud and a microphone, meaning I drop bombs on the mic. It's um, shitty. It is very shitty, and, and my ex did it, and she was supposed to be a good tattoo artist, but she liked to do it too much. Um, um, these are sh more shitty tattoos of mine. There's a pyramid and spaceships. Penises. There's no penises. That was rude. <laughs> and the clown? And question marks. Why? Because I'm mysterious. It's because he's tarded and he doesn't know what he's thinking. That also. says rape. It says rape. That says rape. Rape. I said rape. <laughs> <laughs> that says stupid. Uh, that says smoked out. You skipped one. I'm not doing it. Just shut the fuck up. He has young money on his arm. <laughs> now we're not using this video. We have to do it all over again. <laughs> we gotta do it all over again. <laughs> ah, damn, you fucking bitch. Oh, you fucking dyke. <laughs> oh, you went and done it. Ah. Uh, he was also a stupid teenager. I, I got this fucking tattoo when I was 15. I was drunk as fuck. I was high as fuck. I had like 50 bucks and I was like, give me a fucking tattoo. Then that's what happened. So fuck whatever. It's going to be covered up as soon as she gets around to fucking drawing up the damn design. He gets them for free so I can do them whenever I want. Yeah, so that means I gotta wait. Um, that is a fucking bomb blowing itself up. It's self destruction. Uh, so smoked out. That is a Grateful Dead album cover. <sighs> this is homeboys that died from overdoses. So why do not touch bad shit? Um, fuck, man. I got 19 fucking tattoos. Why the fuck did you make me? That is a tribute to another dead homeboy named Shroom. He killed himself in 2012. This is the most important tattoo that I have. And I have another one of the exact same thing on this uh, other side here. And this right here, if you can see, I did that when I was fucking... 18 drunk with a homemade gun and it just so happens it's some random fucking design that I pulled out of my ass. She has the exact same fucking tattoo all big up on her thigh. The exact same skull. I also did it when I was 18 in the middle of the night and drunk. Yeah. So. In the wintertime. Um, yeah, that's pretty dope. It's just a little. Not much. Use your muscles. Right. Flexible. My muscles are so fucking big, I can't move them. Uh, uh, this one I did on myself. Um, I don't know when. It does. It's it's something. <laughs> it's fucking something. I don't. You know what? It's a fucking skull with a candle and wings, and it's like it's very blasphemous. Yes. It's a very blasphemous tattoo. Um, Jesus Christ, people. <laughs> that is a scorpion, a tribal scorpion with my son's name in it. He's a Scorpio. Um, this is a very, very, very shitty hatchet man that was done with a homemade gun when I was like 16. There's a big ass ugly skull in the middle that says beware. Mm-hmm. It does. Okay, so now I'm done. Thanks for wasting everybody's time. 
Everybody wants to see your tattoos because you're sexy and stuff. So go ahead. I don't have tattoos. I'm a virgin. These are all fake. I paint them on every day. Okay, we're done. Hard. You, I got 19 that I just showed everybody. Yeah, but yours is poop. Mine actually has like detail and stuff too. Mm. <laughs> She's right. I, I don't, I don't, I don't care. Mm. But don't be like, mm, you got your, 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 your. a lot of yours are kind of mm, 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 too. So. Mhm. Mm so I don't go to other artists. Because I suck. No, you don't. You're awesome. Show them your scar. What scar? On your back from me fucking your skin off. Uh, I'm dizzy. Hmm? I got dizzy. Don't be dizzy. I got dizzy. So all the blood is going to your breast. This is. Ooh. Zombie boobies. I designed it. And then the artist, Jason Hodge, fucked it up. And then this says morbid envy. And they also fucked it up. And then <laughs> it's it's poop. Poop. Everybody likes that one. I don't know why. That's kind of cool. I did those when I first started, and then this, which was like a year ago, almost two years ago. And your birdie. And touching machine. <laughs> okay. It you wasn't my the, ass, that can... was my tailbone, and it hurt. No. no what? Kill yourself. No. Then your baby will be daddyless. Is that a problem? My opinion, it is. BDSM. Bloop. Am I supposed to do this? I had to take off my pants. Uh, you could just pull them up. I, like, no, they're not gonna go out that far. Yes, they will. You just want an excuse to take off your fucking pants. I have tattoos on my thighs. You see them all the time. I have a poopy tattoo on my back. Which is a rose and vines and it sucks. And then... I don't know if they can even see it. This is... They have shrunk in some, but this is... Yeah. Skin rippage. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Sorry to waste all of your guys' time. Yep. Yeah. You asked for it, though. And you're the one that gave us 50 goddamn fucking two questions. So, I'm gonna fuck her to death. So you're never gonna hear from Kitten again. She's going to die. Oh, ow. That's what you get. I hope my little bray ring stabs you hard. I told you guys he hates dating me, like, every day. I love it. I love it all. Brody! <laughs> That's it. Mo mohawk. It was a mohawk. Two four mohawks became gay. What the fuck off? Ah! Uh, okay, yeah. Done. You're supposed to. What? I'm supposed to stop it? It doesn't stop on its own? Yeah. <laughs> How about you don't? Hmm? How about don't what? Mm-mm. What? I'm not gonna lick your face. You're so pretty. But don't get it. No. Oh, okay, yeah, you said kill myself. I just want to throw this in. There's a little funny story. I'm at work today, and I text her, <laughs> and I, I say, hey there, sexy. Then I promptly text her after that, uh, 
I know you got a man and shit, but uh, you gonna let me get in that booty? She replies with, kill yourself, lol. <laughs> I thought he was somebody else. I, I Wait a minute, wait a minute. I thought she was, she, obviously I figured she knew it was me bullshitting. Um, so I reply, what the fuck, you stuck up twat. And she replies, deuces, lol. I was about to block him too. And I reply, laugh my ass off, I love you. And she replies, oh my fucking god, I thought you were some random douche. <laughs> I fucking hate you. <laughs> I really thought he was somebody else. So I, was, I was about to block him and then I saw what, what the name was that I was blocking. And I suddenly felt very stupid. Mm. So I figured I'd tell everybody. <laughs> Just to make it a little worse. Uh, oh no. The Did four you? year old is screaming. Maybe he had nightmares. I don't know. But uh, enough of this uh, hour and 11 and 11 and 11 minute fucking video. Oh, that was my titty. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Don't grab my titty if I can't grab your titty. My titty's sensitive too. I'm having a baby also. <laughs> I am. Just inside of your vagina. I'm gonna leave it when I see it. We have seen it on the fucking we've ultrasound. We've seen a bullet. Well, we've heard it multiple times. And a radio station, so I don't know what I'm supposed to believe I, I anymore. I know, we got a whole fucking Mexican soccer team inside there. We're done. We're done. We're done. Thank you all for fucking giving a shit or not giving a shit. I don't. Whatever. So you don't uh, give shits. You take shits. Well. If you give shits, that's unsanitary. Well, we're gonna give Hazard some shits mm -hmm. all over his car.